Hi everyone, how's it going? Uh, I just wanted to, we are live here and I want to, we are here for another session of real estate with Randy Steadwell. And there you go. Real estate with Randy Steadwell. Real estate talk with Randy Steadwell. Uh, and so we are here, we are gonna be joining with uh, uh, Dean Grozowski and uh, and uh, so happy to have him. Uh, we've had him on here before, uh, and, but this was before we changed the name. So I figured we'd bring him back and kind of go from there. So this is episode number five for uh, for this year, and uh, we're about you know, if you want to know his origin story or anything like that, go back into the YouTube channel and see um, the previous episode. Uh, it was one of the actual first episodes that we've done. Uh, so I'm happy to, you know, have him back and we can kind of go over uh, more updated things like the state of this market. Everybody wants to know that, what we're doing, what he's doing for the future things like that, things of that nature. We also have a, a few surprises. He has a few events that he's going to be announcing and kind of taking it from there. So without further ado, um, I'm going to bring in Dean. Dean, how is it going? What's happening, man? How's my lighting? I uh, It's a little dark, but I mean, we can make you out. So. All right, well, I just got this new uh, this light over here and I'm trying to- Oh, the ring light? Oh yeah, yeah. That's I I, I'm I'm using that too. <laughs> Excuse me, but maybe mine's not big enough. That's all right. <laughs> Compensation. So, yeah, anyhow, awesome. thanks again for having me on, man. This is uh, I, I enjoy being on the show and being um, feeling like a star for a little bit. You know, it's like it's oh yeah over here. Well, it's because you are a star. You are a star. Yeah, so, I, I get it. You're the big dipper, all right? Yeah, let's play some prints. It'll be all right. No, no, no. No, I, I'm the small guy. I'm, I'm over here. I'm just trying to ride your coattails over there, you know? So. <laughs> We're just having fun. We just got back from uh, Franklin, Tennessee. Uh, so we're part of a mastermind flip hacking live you heard that web uh, or the uh the event right flip hacking live. yeah yeah okay. so flip hacking live i uh, if anybody doesn't know it was an event that happened down in tampa or was it orlando yep orlando that's where they had it last year yep yeah so uh it was a great event if you ever get a chance to go again i definitely recommend going i did not go myself uh, I had personal things that came up, unfortunately, um, but I recommend anybody from everybody that I have seen has come back with stories upon stories of good things that have happened and people, good people that they met. It's all about networking. No matter where you go to these events, it's not about the speakers that are speaking. I think there's more value in just networking with the people that are there you know no doubt. Uh, you know so it's it's crazy because i don't really like as much as i want to hear the speakers you know like the big time speakers pace morby uh jameel daniels uh you know people like that i uh, it's great to hear them and and things like that but you really go there to to speak with everybody else who's doing the same thing that you're doing to be mm. the come up camaraderie and and you know anybody who is well as who's above your level and you can learn from them. So that's the good thing about places like that is that you can learn from everyone else just by having a conversation and you never know where it leads to in the future. So yeah. I met you at a network meetup and look where we're at now. Yeah, where, where was that? Was it was that at the RIA or where was it? What do you- So I met you actually, um, trying to remember which meetup that I met you at because I, I, I see you at quite a bit of them. Um, I know I met you at the RIA uh, and then I think after a, a few more events we I met you at the like the the one at McVee's pub and and so on and so forth so uh, yeah. Cool. 
But yeah, um, I apologize. I'm still struggling with the lighting over here, but I'm not going <laughs> to dwell on that too much more because it's just going to be like, oh, this guy that's all right. Lighting and, and I swear I, I'm not dwelling on it that much. But I yeah, I'm in a hotel room, so <laughs> you nice know, one. yeah. So it's uh, it's crazy. I had to travel for my day job, um, but you know, whether I'm traveling or not, I'm still coming here to provide value to everybody else and 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 do my best so yeah, um, i'm trying to be as consistent as possible every monday at eight so if you don't know where the next one's going to be it's going to be next monday at eight to put 8 p.m i don't know who i'm going to have on next you never know so yeah, yeah. <laughs> in, in, unless it's next monday at eight unless it's next monday, <laughs> unless it's monday at eight. yeah <laughs> No, so so you were saying you were talking about community and association, and you got a lot of these yes. talking heads that are out there right now. Um, th this is what they're preaching, right? This is like yep. hey, you got to get together. You got to. Like I gotta remember when we were down at um, uh, at Flip Hacking Live, uh, the Pace actually came in to speak, and you know here's um, uh, there was a meetup that he was doing off site, and some people actually went there. You yeah. know, I don't know if I don't know if that was the one that Andre three thousand from Outcast or somebody from Outcast, maybe it was Big Boy showed up. Um Yeah, I think it was Big Boy. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Maybe it was that one. Uh but but in short, like they showed up, him and uh, I think he was with uh, some other guy. Jerry Norton was there as well. Mm, yeah. Um and he says, uh, you know, like networking is key. And you got to like, that was his little, his pitch, you know, yep. like, you, it's all about association, right? So stay, stay with your group, stay with your, you know, your yep. people and grow uh, together. And it's so important with the community. And um, so we're very, very early in the show here. Let's talk about this because I've got um, two events I want to plug. Shamelessly promote these two events. And uh, yes. what we've got is... The 22nd of February, okay? Okay. Uh, the 22nd is uh, going to be uh, one of our masterminds that we do, all right? Uh, there's no charge to get into this one, okay? Uh, yeah, you know, I've already mentioned to you, but you've been to these before. We get a good, we get a good yeah. decent turnout. Um, that one right there, we're going to talk about market statistics. We're going to talk about the trends. and that, That's how I start off all these meetings, right? Okay. So that's the first one to put into the event. Um, or be your, in your event calendar uh, is on the 22nd of this month, all right? February 22nd. That's going to be at 6, uh, 6.30 probably is when we're going to actually kick it off. Uh, and it's at uh, the Keller Williams office over in Novi. And don't worry, we're not pitching you. You know, come be part of Keller Williams. It's like, it's what we're doing, right? It's at 6 we're p.m.? The community, right? You said it's 6 p.m.? 6, uh... Yeah, I arrive at six. I mean, I'll be there at six, but I think we're gonna kick off at six thirty, and do the whole MC thing. I don't um, know exactly who's gonna be on the roster, other than some of the folks that have been at. Uh, uh, well, just got back from Franklin, Tennessee, with us at the Mastermind. So, okay. so anybody who's out there, anybody who's new, right here, event February twenty second at six thirty p.m. Now we will be posting in the fight in our Facebook group. Uh, Metro Detroit off-market real estate group. I will get with Dean. We will post whatever event calendar or anything like that that we, that he's having. We will post it there. Okay. So if you if for some reason you take it off, I will keep reminding you as well every uh, every week um, until the event. But I will be there. Okay. Uh, so February twenty second. Let me look at my calendar. And see when that is. That is. Uh, in Wednesday. two weeks, in, in in two weeks from Wednesday, so you need to be there, especially if you're new. Okay, um, even if you're not new, get to networking with people. Uh, he puts on a great play. Uh, you know, he does great interviews, and uh, he has great people talking. But again, it's just about getting in the room with like-minded people. Period. Okay, I, uh, you know, if you have any questions about that, reach out to Dean. You'll be able to get his information at the end of this end of this show as well, um, and kind of go from there. So that's the first event. Second event is March eighth. 
Okay. March 8th, we've got none other than Bill Allen coming in from Flip Hacking Live. He's the guy who like runs the show. All right. So the guy, he's trained many, many different entrepreneurs and real estate investors. And uh, you know, he's flying in. He's got his own airplane. He's flying in Oakland County Airport. And then we're going to you know, take him over to a venue um, and to meet with some of the uh, people that are already involved in the 7FF team uh, locally. So okay. we're going to do that. And then we're going to get on over to the uh, event. And then again, that's going to be at 6 o'clock. At, um, you know, there's a little meeting spot that we've got going on uh, okay. over in White Lake. We'll get all the addresses. We're going to have an event page and all that. Yep. But uh, I tell you, you know, there's going to be a cover charge for that one. Okay. okay. But I'm talking like this guy's going to bring extreme value. I'll drop the video, the promotion video that we yeah. cut uh, in your page. Uh, that yes. way your people can uh, have a look at it and uh, at least see what this guy looks like and then begin the, you know, the search. Now, um, when you say there's a cover charge, is it, it's not like a thousand dollars, right? Oh, almost. Almost. Okay. Well, it's probably going to be about $25. And what we got to do, we're okay. renting a venue. Gotcha. You know, we're, th this event will definitely outgrow the office. We're going to pay for yeah. some of the things because we don't, I mean, the guy's flying his own plane in and that yeah. costs, um, you know, but, you know, we want to leave him with something. So, so, so in my opinion, $25 is like a drop in the bucket, especially whether you're new, you're not new. It doesn't matter. You pay more than that on a freaking Starbucks for an entire week. Yeah. Okay. Without so get your butt out there. There's no excuses. I, uh, you know, pay the 25 bucks for the cover charge, you know, uh, and kind of go from there again, I will be there. Okay. Um, I, I you know, as long as nothing unforeseen happens, I will be there. Okay. And I, you know, you need to get around like-minded people, people, period, community, 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 period. That network as much as possible all right that i i cannot preach that enough uh anybody who says otherwise i can do this on my own you can but you're not going to grow as fast and you're not going to grow as much yeah, it's, my it's, it's tough business it, it is a tough business if you're doing it on your own you know um ever since reading rich dad poor dad it was uh, it was laid out right there that you got to build your team you know right. And then as this business evolves a little bit, you know, like, and you're truly paying attention to it, like, you've got a, like, let me, let me ask you real quick. Um, yep. What would you say the percentage of uh, wholesalers versus flippers in this group are? So I would probably say there is a good portion. There's probably more wholesalers, um, but a good portion of those wholesalers are also flippers. Okay. And they're also buying hold investors so um you know you still got a lot of buyers that still flip and still buy and hold and you know i i don't know if i could put a percentage on it but you know i i would say we at least have 50 percent um of at least flippers and buying holders both buyers at least 50 percent, if not more so yeah so you know, well, here's here's what ultimately why I bring that up. You know, I've got a lot of different things going on in my uh, my mind right now. You know, coming out of this Franklin, Tennessee event, and um, you know, they're talking about things like AI and how to use it, yep. and you know, look at all, all all this different information. Um, you know, there's uh, you know the real estate market. I mean, right now people are talking. Like, ah, the market's going to crash. The the Fed is raising rates and like all this stuff that we're hearing, right? Yep. Like if it's one thing you can learn from me is is simply um, you need to know your numbers. You need to be able to track your numbers. You need to build your team. Yes. You need but, but all that stuff goes in with it, right? Um, 100%. But 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 moving on from the building the team comment, you you oh, like. For real, you have got to absorb yourself with the information. You, you got to just, you know, absorb it all into your mind that you can. 
and you know and it's not necessarily driving down the road and listening to the music it's like you're listening to the podcast you're listening to uh, like specifically this podcast right yeah. like oh do, you know how many people actually sit down and actually watch dean wave his hands and you know <laughs> you know rather than doing that the way that i listen to podcasts alex hermosi whoever you know yeah. i just put them on youtube i'm right on the phone and just yeah. let it ride 